What's up guys, I am Bree, and you're watching the finale of my Skyward Sword playthrough. We finally made it. I almost quit. If you haven't seen any previous episodes, first of all, I don't know why you, you, you clicked on this one, but like, subscribe, comment, go watch some previous episodes. But if you haven't watched them, then you might not know that this game has been rough for me. Um, I, I, I considered quitting at one point. It started to become not fun in the latter half. But this ending is the whole reason that I came back to play this game like 10 years later after attempting to play it on the Wii. Um, so in between episodes, like I said, I did a little bit of prepping. So first off, I upgraded these po I got upgraded these potions twice, which I didn't realize you could do. Um, I got a Guardian Potion Plus to uh, keep from getting damaged for like three minutes, I think. Then I found that you, then I saw something where you could get this potion metal, so I went and found that. So that this guardian potion keeps me from taking damage for like six minutes. Um, I already had this life metal, I already had this heart metal. Um, I grabbed another heart piece, so I went and finished up my chores at the, the little lumpy pumpkin place, whatever the fuck it's called. Uh, because... Uh, that was just an easy way to grab one more heart container, and I already had did, done two of the, like, the air, and so I just needed to do something real quick with my harp. So I figured I would just do that. I don't care about the Hylene shield, honestly. Like I said, I'm not having fun with this game. I don't want to go do that. Um, I don't care about getting the rest of the heart containers. I think we're set. Like, if I can't beat the ending with this setup, I've done something wrong. I, well, actually, I just suck, and I need to, to, to practice more. Uh, but... Yeah, so, I think we're ready to get into it. I think that's covered everything. Link, it's Girahim. He appeared out of thin air and got the drop on me. Don't worry about me. You must chase after him. Oh. He ran through the great doors of the front of the temple. You may yet catch him before it's too late. Hurry. Okay. Is there any... Can I go anywhere else in here? Is there a little seed? Tree. Wait, which door? I'm guessing this one. He's such a freak. This was a uh, interesting. <laughs> interesting. Well, let's just leave it at that. It's very interesting. <laughs> Honestly, I don't love Gerheim as a as a villain because he's just fucking weird. Hear me, my horse. The spell is nearly complete. The Demon King returns. Until then, you will keep that. Well, you're interfering with my ritual. I don't care if the whole lot of you get lodged at the end of it's on the end of his blade. You will find me the time I need. Do not fear him. Fear my wrath if you fail me. Okay, I know I can run past a lot of these guys. So we're just gonna do that. Oh! 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 Oh!
me a heart, give me a heart. Did I kill them all? Yeah, okay. Oh, kamikaze, kamikaze. Going, just keep going. Oh, there's a bomb next to me. Shit. Oh, nice. Ah! It's okay, that's okay. Wait, give me another one. Give me heart, give me heart. Keep going, right? Yeah. Okay. Woo. Oh, shit, they run fast. They run fast. Oh, we got we got more kamikaze. Run past them, run past them. Oh. Who we killing now? A one dude. Hey, get your ass back. What? Where'd he go? Where's he at? There he is. Area. Okay. Doing good, doing good. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna kill him now. Oh, I hate these guys. I need some hearts, I need some hearts. Give me some hearts. Give me hearts, give me hearts. Okay. What's next? Oh, we're just gonna run past them. Dude, if you... I would hate to, like, actually try to kill all these guys. Ah! They got me. They got me. Wait, is this the end? This is the end? Okay. Am I killing all these guys? You fucker. Was that it? Okay, cool. Part one down. <laughs> You're far too quick, boy. I realize a simple child like you... No, you knows nothing of magic, but spells like this take time and a steady hand. Can't do it quietly like a good boy. You petulant brat, you've pushed me too far. I've waited my whole existence for this. This is my moment. You know what? Fine, if you're so intent on hurrying to your grave, I'll be happy to show you- Ah, uh, I missed it. This time, there'll be no heroic escape. I was a fool to toy with you and let you walk away with your life before, but I won't make this app mistake again. Ooh. Uh, 
That I promise. All right, I did. I did so much better the second Hurricane boss fight than the first. So let's hope <sighs> this one's okay. I can do okay on this one too. If only I'd put you in your place from the very beginning. Show a human a little mercy. Next thing you know, he thinks himself your equal. Oh, is this his true form? Given my station, I had to maintain some semblance of dignity, so I let you run with your life, twice even such a guilty pleasure. But instead of scaring away like any creature with a basic instinct to survive, you just com kept coming back again and again and again. I've let a mere boy make a fool of me for the last time. You stand before a demon, or should I say a weapon, without mercy. For you, boy, I prepared a most appropriate and humiliating death. I even have a pet name for it. I call it the Endless Plunge. First, I will take my time bludgeoning you, and when I grow bored of it, I will drive you to the edge and deliver a last strike to send you falling to your doom. Oh, I wonder why those words are highlighted. Wonder why. I'll delight in casting your body into this pit and snuffing out the flame of your life. Your broken body will serve as a fine sustenance for the Demon King. Okay, drive him to the edge and then fatal blow, got it. I don't know how to do this. I'm gonna learn. Push him back to the edge. Go, go. Oh, is it? It can't be that simple. Go, go, go. Mm. Okay. Nice moves, bro. Oh shit, got me. Got me with this damn kick. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Okay. I think I understand now. How many times do I gotta do this? doing this until we get all the way to the ground. Okay. We are continuing to fight. That was not it. Okay. Dang. about how this fight's supposed to go. Can I hit it with my sword? Okay. Yep. 
it's not doing anything. <laughs> hmm. Damn it. It's hard to get used to the timing on that. Okay, okay, okay. I think we're supposed to be poking him right. Got him. Okay, yeah, poke him. Poke him right in the heart. No swiping. Oh, we got a bigger sword? Pause real quick. I gotta check this notification on my phone. Okay. Nothing important. Oh, whoops. Back up, back up. Oh, shit. This, I hate, this is like the worst parry button clicking in the fucking stick. <laughs> this is preposterous, driven to my knees by a simple child. My simple child of man, laughable. No matter how many times we clash, I can't prevail. You think I can't defeat you? You think I can't win? Boy, what are you? <laughs> Fucking Link. Ah, uh, but never mind that. Victory's still mine to save her while we fought. The ritual I started continued. At least it's complete. Or at last it's complete. The Demon King shall devour the soul of the goddess and resurrect in his full glory. <laughs> Alright, this is the moment I've been waiting for! Present. Where are you? Where are you hanging out? Just came out of nowhere. I've never fully like seen this fight with demise. So I don't know exactly how this is gonna go. Don't you see it's all over? You and your kind have lost. This world and everything in it now belong to darkness. They belong to my master. He looks way cooler in this form. I should have just had him look like this the whole time. Oh. Welcome back to us, Master. Oh. Oh, is, is he becoming the sword? Fuck 
fucking maniac, I tell you. I mean, oh, I mean, it kind of, in a sense, the handle is kind of like the Master Sword, or the Hilt. I mean, he is pretty badass looking. So you are the chosen knight of the goddess. Intriguing. The goddess lowered herself to a mortal existence to keep me imprisoned. How pathetic. The bag of this bag of flesh pales in comparison. It pales in comparison to the magnificence of her previous form. I like how the words are coming across the stream. They're screen. They're like red and they're smaller and then they get bigger. It's kind of cool. Oh. oh shit, we got Groose. Oh shit. When did he come through? No, oh, excuse me. <sighs> Link. I caught her. She's okay. Thank God for Groose, man. Pivotal character in this game. Hmm, so you and that other human would stand before obliteration to aid the goddess, would you? How curious, the humans I've known were weak things. Hardly more than insects shivering under rocks and ready to flee at a mere glimpse of me. Humans are Hylians. They seem to be used interchangeably. When, I, when last I walked this world, they did little more than scream and cling to their goddess, mewling and praying, counting on her to protect them. How amusing to think those cowards begot someone like you. I think that's how you say that word. You grow more fascinating by the second human. I never imagined I'd meet one of your kind who wished to stand against me in battle. Very well, then I shall prepare a place for us where we will not be bothered by distractions. If you still have the courage to face me, seek me there. Oh, we're not doing it here, huh? Link, it's all on you. Oh, and listen up. Granny has had some info for you. The old girl says it'll take time for that grease wad to absorb Zolda's soul completely. If you can take him down before her soul gets sucked up into that thing, you might still have a chance. Okay, so I'm like on a time limit to kill him. I know you can do it. So yeah, you've got to do this. You're all Zelda's got. You've got to make this happen. If you fear for your life, do not follow me. You can spend what little time your world has left cowering and crying as befits your kind. But if you truly desire to raise your blade against the world, I would build come for me. I waited eons to return. I can spare a few moments to let you decide. Oh, where's it going? How do I get there? It's up to you now. Link. It's always up to Link. Carry the goddamn world on my shoulders. So I guess I go. I would go in there. Um. Will it let me go back to the temple? I think I can sit on a stool and recover my health.
We're so close, so close to finishing. All right, where's my stool? Oh, here we go. Well, hold on. Okay, just rupees. Let's just sit here and wait. Okay, yeah, it does work. Oh, that's somewhat fast. No, he's all right. That's all I wanted. Okay, so we made it through both fights without having to use any of our potions, so I feel pretty good about that. There was a save statue down here, wasn't there? Wait, do I need to go back up? Save, save statue? Save, oh, there it is. Okay. It was hiding from me. I mean, I see the automat- I see the auto saves when I walk up to it, but I feel like I just have to. Alright. Master Link, I have important information for you. Once you enter this portal, my analysis indicates a 0% chance that you'll be able to return unless you are able to vanquish your foe. Are you ready to proceed? I'm ready. Understood, Master Link. Know that even in the place that lies beyond this portal, portal I will be with you. And Master. Good luck. This is definitely cool. Ah, uh, so you've decided to meet your end in battle after all. It pleases me greatly to see such misplaced valor, human. Take a moment to appreciate your surroundings, for where we stand shall serve as your tomb for eternity. I mean, it's very pretty. <laughs> you wouldn't expect to go into somewhere so pretty. The hate for the gods that has boiled in my veins. You will taste all of it in the bite of my blade. The only question left is how long you will manage to remain standing before I take your life. Try to keep it interesting for me, would you? And when you do fall, know that your world and everything in it is mine to dominate, mine to subjugate, mine to rule. When I finish with you, you can take solace in knowing your friends and kin will soon follow as I wipe all who oppose me from the face of this world. Let's go. It won't be long now. At last, the almighty power I've sought for millennia. I will take the Triforce for my own. And the world shall be under my foot for eternity. All right, here we go. Here we go. Demise. Shit. Oh. Fuck up my shield. Oh shit. Oh, he got me, he got me. Going down. Is this like where we have to trick him like with Gary? What fee? Target locked. Demise. This eternal being has conquered 
time itself, it is the source of all the monsters. According to tales passed down through generations, it appears differently in each epic and to each person who lays on eyes on it. Okay. That wasn't helpful, Fee. I know he's coming for that second one. Oh, god damn it. You distracted me, Fee. Did something. Oh, 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 we're scared. This shit's gonna be serious. Oh, fuck. Oh, look, face him, face him, idiot. Oh, fuck. No, no, use it. Use it, Link. Where is he? Oh yeah, God. Oh no. Oh no. I'm not the electrified sword. I'm not good at this. Face him, Link. You idiot. Hold on. Hold on. Ugh. Okay, we won't take damage for a little while. Shield. <sighs> oh, there we go. There we go. Fatal blow. Oh, shit. Did I miss? I don't know. I can miss. That's fine, we're not taking damage. Oh, why do I keep 
keep missing. Is that part of it? Am I doing something wrong? Or am I just supposed to do the Skyward? sure if I was doing something wrong or if I just had to go through that so many times. Ooh, good thing I had that guardian potion because that having to, mm. I'm assuming this is the end. Very cool, very cool. Extraordinary. You stand as a paragon of your kind, human. You fight like no man or demon I have ever known, This, though this is not the end. My hate never perishes. It is born anew in a cycle with no end. I will rise again. Those like you, those who share the blood of the goddess and the spirit of the hero, they are eternally bound to this curse. An incarnation of my hatred shall ever follow your kind, dooming them to wander a blood-soaked sea of darkness for all time. And so the cycle begins. I've confirmed the eradication of the Demon King. His residual consciousness has been absorbed into the Master Sword. Yeah, that was interesting. It's now sealed away. Why do you look sad, Lee? Is Zelda okay? She should be. I think she is. Most positive she is. In fact, I know she is. You have done well, Link. <sighs> yep, there they are. Link! Thank you. I think it's over. Finally. It's all over. Well, for you. Oh. <laughs> nice going, you two. You guys are totally amazing. This little adventure I like to call the Legend of Cruise, of course. That's a little joke. Joke or not, your contributions to our effort efforts were heroic. You have my thanks first. For real, though. Bruce, important hero in this story. Ah, uh, well, you know. Just glad I could make myself useful. I'm happy things turned out okay. Hey, so things look pretty sewn up here. What do you guys say? Ready to head back to our own time? 
Granny was really worried about you two. We don't want to keep the old girl in suspense too long. <laughs> Ilya, your grace. Or perhaps you prefer Zelda. It pleases me to know you are safe. Oh, is that the first time Fee has addressed her? <laughs> At least that we've seen, I think. Master, I must speak with you. Well, she calls Link Master, not Hylia. Master Link, you have successfully protected the goddess reborn and defeated Demise, fulfilling your role as a hero of legend. I suppose, though, if she is the spirit of the Master Sword, her whole purpose is uh, tied to Link. <laughs> My purpose here is complete. Therefore, I ask you to dissolve our arrangement as Master and Servant. Let free her! Let her go! Drive the sword into the pedestal before you, and I will return to the sword to enter her sleep without end. Oh. Master, you have achieved the purpose you are chosen to fulfill. Please set the sword on the pedestal and bring the goddess's mission to an end. Why can't I just hold on to it? Now, Master, it is time to conclude our necessary companionship. My purpose was to obey the command of the goddess and lead you, the chosen hero of this land, on your quest. When I first awoke and began this task, I perceived it as merely serving my function as a servant to her grace. However, I have come to consider the information corresponding to our time together among the most precious data I have on record. Oh. <laughs> I do not have the capability to fully understand the human spirit, Link. And now, at the end of my journey with you, as I prepare to sleep within the Master Sword forever, I accept all oh, I experience a feeling I, might, I am unable to identify. I lack sufficient data to be sure of my conclusion, but I believe this feeling correlates closest to what your people call happiness. Our partnership is at an end, and even as we speak, I feel my consciousness fading away. Oh, that's interesting. So the Master Sword... Is like friends with Link throughout his journey and all his incarnations. Before I entered the sleep that calls me to the sword, I wish to relate to you words that I recorded many times over the course of our journey. So it's like a special relationship between Link and the Master Sword. Even more special than I realized before. Many have said them to you thus far, but now I wish to say them for myself. Thank you. <laughs> Master Link, may we meet again in another life. Oh. You know what? I this I feel like this story between Link, Zelda, and the sword, and the find and finding their purpose. It's I think it's very well told. I'll give them that. <laughs> What? Impa, why? Come with us. Zelda, your grace. You possess the memories of the goddess. You must understand why that is not possible. I am a being of this age. My place is here. <clears throat> I know that. You 
You must return to your own time. I will take care of the gate once you have passed through. I can't do that. You and I have been through so much together. I don't want to leave you alone. Please, Impa, come back. Zelda, at the command of the goddess, have passed through the gate of time. I did so to protect you and aid the fight to prevent the world's destruction. The last remnants of demise are decaying slowly within the sword. Someone must stay behind to watch over this blade. Oh, interesting. Yeah, we are leaving in the past, huh? So I couldn't come back and get it if I fucking wanted to. The spirit must not reawaken. He must never be allowed to threaten the world again. This is the nature of the task given to my tribe. As a member of the Sheikah, the goddess's chosen guardians, I gladly welcome this duty. <laughs> Zelda shall watch over the Triforce. Its power is too great to leave in the grasp of man. Dependence on its might is an invitation to disaster. When it has served its purpose, it must be secreted away to lay dormant once again, the knowledge of its existence hidden from mortal history. These are the words the goddess spoke to me long ago. I remember them well, as do you, I'm sure. How old are you, Impa? Well, we know she lives a long time, obviously. But she's still alive and present. It's got the Triforce on it. Do not despair, Zelda. You and I will surely meet again someday. We do. the cough. <laughs> See, you didn't have to wait long at all, Zelda. You had to wait like fucking 30 seconds to see him again. See? I told you. We'd meet again. <laughs> no! you for everything. Oh no, okay, it's still there. Obviously. Oh, okay.
Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. I know there's another scene after this. Are we rolling credits first? We are rolling credits first. All right. Well, I did it, you guys. I fucking did it. I finished it. I'm very, you know what, I'm very happy I did. Because, oh, I, oh, we see everything from Zelda's point of view here. Very happy I finished it. At least I can say I gave this game a solid chance. I wanted to quit there for a second. So let me say that the story of this game is very cool. And I wanted to experience that ending part for myself. The whole reason I decided to try playing this game again after trying to play it on the Wii and absolutely hating the motion controls. Um, at least the combat is a little bit better. It's a little bit better on the Switch. Um, I still don't love it. It's still hard to grasp. Especially with like the gadgets, switching gadgets, pulling it out. And it doesn't help playing Tears of the Kingdom in the middle of playing this where it's like a little bit different, so I'm getting all mixed up. Um she's got her harp. So obviously I was I was you know, I was felt like it was a pretty solid experience the first half of this game, but then when you have the minute you have to go back, backtrack start backtracking. To the woods, the volcano, and the desert. It started to get a little bit slow. A little bit slow for me. Um, and not fun. A little bit repetitive and not fun. Just watching. Maybe the scene I'm thinking of is at the end of the credits, I'm not sure. But yeah, as I, as I, as I was saying, it so that so along with like the repetitiveness and then tied together with some like control frustrations. I did I I ooh, it's starting to really get on my nerves this game. I started to not have fun. Um, so do I regret playing this whole freaking game just to see the ending and experience the ending for myself? I'm gonna say no, because it was told so well. Um, surprisingly, like, a little bit emotional. I didn't expect that. Um, I feel like we see... Especially when I compare that to like uh, Tears of the Kingdom, how f with how far I've gotten gone through it right now, it's like some heavy, some sad stuff, and like, like you don't see like Link like react at all, like emotionally. Um, in this game, he definitely does, and I really like that. Shigeru Miyamoto. Um, so I, like I really like I really like how Link and Zelda. A lot of the characters are portrayed in the story. Like I said, I Skyward Sword HD stuff. Um, I don't know what, what's Tantalus. Is that is that the studio? I don't know what that is. Um, what was I saying? I forgot. I forgot where I was going with that. Um, so while I'm glad I played this game. I'm not sure I would ever play it again. <laughs> uh, maybe if I want to experience that ending again, I'll watch like a, I'll watch a playthrough, or I'll just not a full playthrough, just watch someone play the ending part on YouTube. Um, yeah, this is definitely 
not my favorite Legend of Zelda game. Like I said, cool story, cool ending, very emotional, like that. Gives more weight to, I think, the other games. Especially, like, I'll probably think of that every time I pull the Master Sword, for sure. With that, that moment with Fee. Oh yeah, that's all my thoughts. That's all I got so far. Uh, that's all, or right now, anyways. That's all my thoughts. Um, we'll wait for these credits to roll through, because I'm pretty sure there's another scene. So when that pops up, I'll see you in a sec. Here we go. Wait. Oh, we're down on the surface. That's right, because that statue's down on the surface. They're coming down. Oh, shit. around us. As a child, I always dreamed of a world below. I wanted to see the surface with my own eyes and feel the land's warm breeze on my skin. I, I think I want to live here. I always want to feel solid ground beneath my feet. See the clouds above my head and watch over the Triforce. Yeah. What about you, Link? What will you do now? <laughs> Where are our loft wings going? Come back. The end. Oh! I thought there was more to that. Okay, well. There we go. The end. What now? Is there more? Oh god, no. No. I am not playing again in hero mode. Sure, return to title screen without saving. You know what? And then if I ever wanted to experience the ending again, I could just play the ending myself. So, there you have it, guys. Skyward Sword. I did it. I beat it. We saw the ending. Goal complete. So I'm going to say if you've watched any of these episodes, any or all, Thank you so much for watching. Uh, thanks for sticking around through my irritation and my frustration. It happens, alright? Playing video games is not always sunshine and roses and rainbows. Um, but you know what? I played it. Done. Checklist. It's off. We're good. We finished it. <laughs> Again, thank you for watching. Um, my next series, I think... I'm probably going to play Assassin's Creed. The first one. I've never played an Assassin's Creed. So we're gonna do that. See, I'll probably I know the Assassin's Creed, at least the first one, is let's just say not as it's a big leap be between the first and the second game, so I know that the first one will not be like representative of what the rest of the series is like, so I'll probably play at least the first two, but I feel like it's really important to experience the first one and to appreciate how that was the foundation for the rest of the series. So we're starting there. So I think that's next. 
if you're interested, subscribe. So you can be notified when that goes up so you can watch it. So thanks for watching this episode, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.